Hey everyone, so here's a very cool tutorial for you guys on how to upscale an image. Now usually when you upscale an image, uh, it'll look very pixelated because there's not much information and it'll look really blurry. But now with uh, this new software called Topaz Labs Gigapixel, it allows you to upscale an image and it'll actually look really good. And you can upscale it by two times, four times, or even six times. Now I'm not very sure how this uh, software works, but it uses AI learning in order to guess and estimate of how an image is going to be using various examples of multiple images. And uh, that's just one way it guesses and it estimates of how um, it's going to be and it recreate the image for you, pretty much. Um, so basically, uh, it's very easy to use. All you have to do is go on their website. I'll provide the link in the description box and download it. Now, unfortunately, it's not free, but you can get the 30-day trial, which is very generous of them. And if you're really into your photo editing, I definitely recommend uh, recommend buying the software. So what you want to do is uh, download and install it. It'll take a it, it'll take a while to install because it's kind of a big software. But after it's done, you have to uh, make an account with um, Topaz Labs, and it's it's free, and open up the software. And this is what it'll look like. It's uh, it's very easy to use. The user interface is very nicely uh, put. Um, I I begin by showing you guys an example um, of an image. So here's an image I took um, of uh, of a seal, and you can as you can see, it's a very small image. And if I zoom in, uh, it's gonna look like that. It's very pixelated because it's a very small image. Now, I want to upscale this image. So what you want to do is uh, go into Topaz um, Gigapixel, and then search for the image, browse for it, and open it. And uh, it'll give you a preview of um, what the scaling up's going to be. And even by that far, it's gonna, it, it looks so good. So it's going to be scaled by 4%. I want to scale it by maybe six, uh, 6 times. And it'll give me another preview. It's still very good. Um, now you can change, uh, play around with these settings called suppressor noise. I usually leave it at, at medium, and remove uh, remove blur. I usually put it to low. Um, it's just the way I like it, but you can also play around with that. And uh, that's that's basically it. So next, what you want to do is uh, you want to uh, select the output folder. So I'm just gonna go custom folder, and I'm just gonna resave it into my downloads. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. You can uh, change the prefix of the output folder, but I'm just going to leave it at default and go start. And it will take a while. And it's done. That didn't take that long at all. So if I go to my downloads where I saved it, here's the new image. And as you can see, it's been upscaled and it looks much better than the old image. Now obviously it's not 100% perfect, but it does a pretty decent job. Um, if, you, if I compare it with the old image, like that, and here's the new image. So I think this software is still developing and then in a couple of years this will be uh, very very um, much more um, advanced and it will get to a really good level where we can upscale various images and it will look perfect. But uh, so far with currently what we have this software gets the job done. Um, hopefully you guys found the video to be useful. Um, if you have any questions just leave it in the comment section below. Like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.